Hey guys, welcome back. Um, so this is kind of embarrassing. It's been a long time since I've done this, but I guess I double clicked the record button and did not record for the past 20 minutes. So essentially you miss like an entire episode of me walking around this maze area and uh, I guess cursing the enemies because they're pretty annoying. Uh, so really you didn't miss much. And we're just gonna keep going because normally I would go back and just re-record it all but nothing happened seriously I got to this area with the purple hallway and this purple hallway does require you to use the core shield and we have a new enemy Harass Velger um, but yeah it requires you to use a core shield because if you walk through it normally it will start damaging you. It's weak to gun, and only gun. I'm still gonna use fire on you. And miss, wow. I'm perfectly fine with you reverting me because that'll save me a lot of turns. Uh, let's see, I got a new ammo for Gale in one of the chests. And that's pretty much it. They learned some abilities, I guess. That's worth mentioning. Yeah. We are running kind of low on MP and stuff, but I could just, if I really, really felt the need, I could use one of these datas on them. Um, but we are okay right now. I think I've got, I have enough chakra drops to keep everyone sustained for a bit. I do want to go through here to check out what's on the other side because I got teleported like right here after I walked through a portal. And then I took the south path to find that save point. But I'm using Fire Drain here because I learned since the last episode that Explode is a fire type move. And all I have to do is cast Fire Drain every single turn. And I, I don't have to worry about getting murdered by Explode. There we go. Uh, I also mentioned how you guys mentioned and told me that, oh, uh, we did run into this new enemy, Legion and they are weak to thunder. So, uh, definitely not nearly as bad as the Chimeras, but yeah. We're just gonna hit them with thunder over and over. I believe fire also works. They're not weak to it, but I can hit them. They do have quite a lot of HP but they're not really anything to be scared of. It looks like this'll just take me back, but I will hit this portal just to, for the sake of completion, and because there might be treasure. No. Okay. I will check out this room though. Yeah. Yeah, so even though we skipped a lot, um, I mean, you're, you still get to see me exploring this maze dungeon.
And I'll show you the gun in a second, the new ammo that he has. It's pretty nice. Yeah, so he has the Neutron Shot, which I believe... 88 power and it poisons, so... Pretty nice. And we got a Jasmine. Nice. Okay, I believe it's the south portal here. That takes me where I want to go. Uh. Yeah, this should take me back to the purple hallway. And my shield ran out, so I will use another one. Right, you guys told me that that roaring that you hear in the background... Yeah, that's not... That's not Meganata. Uh, we, we came here a little too quickly for Meganata to arrive, so... Well, I guess we'll see what it is... Once we get there. But I noticed these guns... I mean, they're supposed to inflict status ailments, but they're pretty damn bad at it. I've not seen a single enemy poisoned or muted yet. I think Sarah's is just a straight up shot, but yeah. Everything else seems okay. I will make another save. Um, we're still quite a ways away from the next mantra level up. I did gain like two or three new mantras in the episode that is now lost. Um, nothing important. I did consider... I mean, what I, I did was I mentioned that I'm going to continue with um, Cielo going down the ailment route and maybe having Sarah learn Earth a little bit just so I can cover that. And why am I... Yeah, so I want Sarah to go down the ailment route, or the earth route, after she learns Rend Asunder, which she is doing right now. And the reason for that is because, well, you guys seem pretty insistent that I get Cielo Null ailments as soon as I can. And I do need that Earth coverage, so Sarah will be the one to do it. She can learn it faster because of Rend Asunder as well. And we've got a new enemy, Throne, who's probably weak to ice. So I don't know why I did that. I did notice that for Sarah, we don't get to increase her stats like we did with Surf. So that's actually going to be a little tough for us. Yeah, Huang Long Dragon Ring. Oh, okay. Um, since you're a special battle, I don't think Spyglass is gonna work. Hopefully, this does work. Good. I'm gonna heal up. We're gonna play this a little safe, and let's try Thunder. Okay. 
I'm scared because there's Sakura raging, and I know how powerful Sakura rage is. Okay, and they have Earth. That's fine. There we go. Okay, you're gonna give me the Dragon Ring now. Let's see... What is the Dragon Ring? Increases resistance to all mighty attacks. Oh my goodness. I'm um, not something I'm going to be... I'm gonna keep them equipped on. But something I will definitely be using in various battles. Uh Oh, so we made it to the other side of that portal. Okay. And this is another chaos shield area or core shield. Let's go ahead and use another one. Okay, another save point. At this at this point, I'm not gonna bother. I don't know, I probably should go back. Like I really wanna just keep going forward. But I should go back and check out the other portals. I know where the save point is now. So I want to check out the portals just in case because I don't want to miss anything important. Like for example, if I didn't check that pathway, I would have missed the dragon ring. I don't want to miss anything like that. So I am going to go back. If there's nothing, I'm just going to cut to when I get back to that save point. All right. Uh, yeah, there wasn't anything. They just took me back to the hallway. So let's check out these areas first. That one leads back here. This one takes me back into the hallway again which means I have to use another core shield. It's a good thing we bought 20. All right, I guess this is the way to go. And an unknown presence. Okay, let's, let's make sure we're all good then. I did save before. So, let's go in and see what it is. Don't come any closer. Stay away. All right, two chimeras. That's fine. Okay. Sometimes it's so weird how they just give you a normal battle behind a door. Like it tricks you into thinking you're about to get absolutely murdered by a boss or something. And then it's it's easier than your regular encounters. Okay, this one's weak to gun. Hopefully you will ma revert me, cause that'll be nice. 
I will just go ahead and revert you. That's free. And then you can go ahead and Medaya. Ugh. I really wish you would just hit me with that. Okay, we got a star ruby from that. And a follow-up ring. What is this? Sounds interesting. Let's see. Reduce turn icon loss from missed attacks. So even if I miss, it's not a missed turn. Or it, it becomes like a half turn. I mean, it's pretty good. Um, oh, you know what that would be really good for? The brains, right? And speak of the devil. Okay, let me open my, uh, my little notes thing okay okay we have Zan and not Agi right now um, I could easily just go online and find out all the patterns and stuff but the reason why I'm not doing that is because these guys aren't really necessary to beat the game Figuring out their pattern and taking advantage of them just minimizes like the amount of grinding that I have to do in the future, which obviously is very nice, but it's not something that I have to do, as opposed to like the Jack Frost, which I have to do in order to unlock an optional boss. So that I will look for, look a guide for in order to answer all the questions correctly. But for these brains, I'm just gonna do it normally. I'm gonna write down the patterns that I find out, but I'm not going to go out of my way to find and write down the patterns. Okay, let me write that down. We got fire. So Agi, okay, okay. Let's see, so following Agi, let's try Zeo. Not Zeo. And if I had the follow up ring, I think I would have another turn. I, th I don't, I'm not sure if that works if they shield the attack. Ooh, I don't have any other elements for you. So let's use ice instead. And not ice. Okay. Pretty good. Pretty good development in our, I guess, our notes. And we get Rend Asunder. Wonderful. I'm gonna go ahead and equip that in place of that and you're gonna need at my bonus let's just get rid of mabufu i have not used mabufu at all in this dungeon at least there we go And I might as well go back to this save point here. Alright, so for you, I can go Vidya Raja or Fire Lord. 
I'm gonna go Vidya Raja, because that's that's the ailment route. And hopefully, eventually, null ailment is coming soon. And then you, Sarah. I don't see AP divide anywhere. I'm assuming AP divide is probably going to be one of these purples. But I do need someone to start working on Earth, so... Now that you have Rend Asunder, it shouldn't take too long to get you started on Earth. So let's just get you that. I'm gonna keep going for a little bit longer. Um, as you can imagine, I do in fact have quite a bit of time now. Uh, with the way, with the current situation. So, uh, I might actually start looking into possibly streaming again, maybe some one off games in the near future because of all the time that I have in the next two weeks or so. But uh, no, no guarantees yet. If there's an interesting game that I want to play, then I might go ahead and do that. Okay. Uh, this is confusing because I can't just walk up. I kind of want to look at the ailment skills that I got for you. Um, so it looks like Foul Breath is the only one that actually does damage at the moment. I know I'm going to have other ones that can do damage while hurting. But I guess I'll keep you on Foul Breath. Um, I'm gonna keep Mudo, but Hama is kind of worthless. It's so bad. It never hits. It only does half their HP. Like, there's really no point using it. Unfortunately, I can't even use Poison Breath or Foul Breath here because the Chimera resists poison. Now we have Earth coverage, so we can finally beat down those stupid Chimeras. Um, I want to keep Fire Boost because she does so much damage. Muragon is really good too. Alright, well, 
I guess we have to give up fire boost. At least for now. I could get quickly. I could get you Rakarmdra. And then this is Six Realms Revive Magic. They're both Revive Magic. I want you Fire Emperor, so I can get that Fire Amp and Aggie That's gonna be fun. All right, we're gonna keep going for a little bit at least. Maybe I can get to the next save point. So we're gonna go here. That's gonna take us up. And then we could finally explore this path. Probably what's gonna happen is I'm gonna walk into another portal that's gonna take me straight back into that save area. And I'm gonna have to do all this again. That's sort of how things have been going so far. That one wasn't so bad. That one just took me here, saves me some time. And now we know the right one is this path here. Okay. And we're going down again. Uh, this looks very familiar to the last floor. Where they gave me a dragon ring. We have a kind of new enemy, an Orthrus. We haven't run into any Orthrus yet. Medical gear. That must be the next step up after Met Tools. Okay, if this is anything like the last one, it is not. I used a Stoma Spray by accident, but I'm not going to complain because... If it works, it works. <gasps> oh. I am gonna hit that real quick. And then I'm gonna go back to explore the other side of that pathway there. But this seems to be the right way. And the other path probably just has some treasure for us. Oh, 
Oh my god, Hecaton Kyries. How do you even fit here? Weak against Earth and ailments. Alright. Don't kill me, please. I'm really glad I got Terra now. Okay, and that was enough to get you Sky Dragon. So let's set that real quick. I didn't even set Zanma yet, jeez. Uh... I mean, I, I don't really have to put... I do want to put that, though. I am really behind on setting these abilities. Okay, we came all this way for this one box. Okay. You know what? I'm not even angry. That was worth it. And we are dead. Oh my god. Okay. I thought we were done there. Yeah, you better be frightened. Yeah, we're just gonna get rid of that guy real quick. And now we can revive you. And that was dumb because you just elect drained. Okay. Enemy. Okay, I'm just gonna throw a cross bomb. Okay. I probably should have remembered that. Because that's not the first time that that has happened. I mean, it's the first time in this game that that, that, that has happened, but, um... I saw my life flash before my eyes there. That was not pleasant. And now I am deathly afraid of running into more Loas. Because 
I was planning to spyglass him had we another turn. And we did not. So I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here at this life terminal. We're going to heal up. And next time, after I have collected my bearings, uh, we're going to continue in this forsaken area, which honestly, if we stay here l too long, is probably going to drive me insane. But until then, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.